Y'all ever read about that time where Dr. Doom took his eyes out and replaced them with the reality and the time stone? And it was revealed to be Mr. Fantastic? Kang figured out it was a damn time quake, right? That shit was echoing back in time, causing new events to happen in the Marvel Universe. Some of them already happened, like the damn uh, the Punisher shit you see right here. Iron Man being a god. He even predicted uh, Blood Hunt and an event that's gonna happen real soon. He figured out that it was a wild timeline out there causing all this shit. And that that timeline was a part of the 616 and it was trying to reattach itself to the main timeline. And he only thought of one motherfucker that, uh, that can do this shit. Doom, he said, let's go hunt that motherfucker. Before he leave, a whole bunch of death locks came up on him. He murked the fuck out their ass by himself. He already know who the fuck sent them. It was Avengers Prime, Loki, the strongest Loki in the multiverse. But he ain't having no time with that shit. He had to hurry up and leave. And there were some people in this place, right? He left their ass to die. So they go over to this pirate timeline, the, uh, the other timeline that's trying to transfer, uh, reattach itself to the main one. Everybody dead to the motherfucker. You see Celestials, everything, dead to the motherfucker. The dude he was with was figuring that it, it probably could have been him. He was like, no, I like a challenge. There ain't shit here for me. The fuck I would even want to do this shit for. So they walk, right, and they get over to this big-ass door. Get up in there, and they see Doom. But it ain't Victor Von Doom. It's Reed. What happened was they got very bad in that damn timeline, right, very quickly. They didn't know what was happening to the world, not at first. When the old times crept in, when Entrophy uh, buried at the edges of the world, we rallied together. We were the heroes. We could have uh, saved everything. It was beautiful at first. But all that did was take a quick death and slow it down. A mercy turned into a torture. The world was still sick, still dying. The entropic uh, death of our timeline was still occurring. Just an inch at a time, the world lost hope. Do you know what happens to a society without hope, Kane? Total collapse. He never lost hope for his world. The trade-off was that he threw everything away for his, uh, any hope for himself. He would do anything to save the world. He replaced his eyes with the time and reality stones and it, uh, to force his will upon the timeline. He killed the Celestials and drank their blood to take their power for himself. He destroyed everyone who raised a hand, raised even their voice against him. And his mission, his mission was to save the timeline. After that, after all that, no matter how well in, into, uh, intention his ac actions were, what else could he have been called but Doom as he put his helmet back on? Kane tried to shoot his ass, but he put a shield up. This motherfucker make a whole bunch of damn time clones of himself. Then they got the brush on him. Bro got the uh, dodging that shit off. He tried to come around him, but that shit shattered the damn sword when he tried to hit him. He throws his ass back. He said, keeping your arsenal in pimp space, Kane. Let's end that. Make his damn guns and shit come out of the damn micro space it was in. Kane picks up this mace, right? Runs up on his ass. He's like, bitch, I'm a god here. Grabs Kane by his fucking throat. Then he's like, you know what? I ain't finna kill you as a god. You not worth it. He said, no, I'm going to kill you as a man because I'm better than you are. You stripped of your toys, me setting aside my powers, all of them, if only for a moment. It's just blood and uh, bone and muscle now, Kane. And I am your better. I am. His ass get fucked up by the old dude that was with Kane the whole time. Kang was pissed. He was like, you stepped into a single combat? I should murk your ass. He was like, I already know. But I couldn't let your ass fucking die. Because if he if he uh, killed you, everything would have been dead anyway. He laughed. He was like, come on. This shit went according to plan. So they leave, right? And his plan was basically Doom always fucking arrogant as hell. So he that's why he fucked himself up. He was relying on that. And he left him the, uh, back in his timeline to write the book about Doom. And he said that this message kept popping up. And if you don't know who this is, this is Miracle Man. A, a powerful ass. Reality warping ass. Uh, he writes the damn story itself type of Superman clone. That's a whole different video. I'm done though. I just thought that was a hard ass version of Doom. A good reveal.